Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are doing a little bit of the last few updates on islands. Um, I didn't do the last few updates, so we'll cover that too. We do have this update here, which is the fireflies. And as you can see, there's a yellow one there. If I go into my inventory, there's a nut. Okay, where'd it go? Over here. You can catch them, and then you can actually make lights out of them. See, it just made the yellow firefly jar. And there are different colors. I have so far caught the yellow, which is the most common. There's green, there's red. Those ones that I have caught. Supposedly there is blue, there is rainbow, there is, um, I think the purple is a new one. It's somewhat rare. I have been done to start working, like adding onto my island. The new update that just came out on Friday is a factory. And, and mine should be actually doing another, um, maybe update spot. Oh, here's a green one. I don't know if I'm going to be able to catch it. The controls get a little... Ooh, I caught it. So does that mean is there a red one around here? Let me check real quick and see if there's a red one floating around. Because normally if there's a green one, there is sometimes a red one. The problem is my island is so big that by the time it hits daylight, I keep forgetting I bought doors for the blue house. Yeah, it's too... The fireflies, of course, only come out at night. Um, you can also tra trap the bees in there. And they also... We'll go over a little bit of the updates. There has been quite a few since I have last... Did a video on this. There's the bees also. Um, in order to get the bees, there has to be a lot of flowers around, and then it will just pick random trees to put in the honeycombs in. And all my bees like to gather and put them in here. I think all together I have four, at least four, maybe five hives. Most of them are up here near the portal. There is a couple over by the blue house. That is another update that happened. I know I've been behind, but when I got inventory wiped, it I had to start over so much from scratch, and I have still been like really grinding. And the problem with grinding too, like depending on the area, if it's grinding slimes and underwater I found that you get the best results from being in public servers. The only problem with being in public servers is you have people that will sit there and they will try to like they'll wait until you have a pink slime and then they'll like try to attack it or if you're underwater they'll try to steal all the rocks. I just I don't understand it but it makes it like very hard so then you have to go to your private server which can be quite boring at times. I mean at least if you're in a public server you can read chat or sell stuff. But for this factory update I have not completed it all. I have been trying as much as I can the last two days and I haven't managed. They have this drill now and I will go over to the one that is working. But these little islands, as you can see, they're far away. The other one wasn't as bad. The other one popped up first. This one popped up yesterday. I think it's every 20 hours one will pop up, but I don't know how many max since it's still new. I don't know if only two will pop up or where all they're located, if they pop up all around. As it's still new, we don't know. But this is a drill. If I go in, the problem with it is it only takes one cola at a time. 
So it's a very slow moving, but I will show you how it operates on the other side. Let's see if I can find so I don't fall off my own. But this one popped up last night, and I just wanted to get a drill in there. Whatever you do, do not, you can use your axe, but don't, because if so, that area will basically disappear and you have to wait another 20 hours and it's in real lifetime not 20 game hours in real lifetime for another one to spawn so we will go over in the workshop which they changed since we last did this um and now what was the one? Oh, it's on the other i will show you the anvil in a minute you have the copper press which needs five steel rods, and the steel rods are harder to get. Um, the drill will give you the copper, and then if you put a smelter, you can get the copper ingots. The, in order to get the drill, you need one crystallized iron, um, one blue sticky gear, and eight steel rods. The steel rods are like the hardest to get right now. And I will explain in a minute. You also have the steel mill, which converts iron ingots into the steel. And you need 50 gold and 100 iron. These aren't as bad. Um, the only problem is smelting the gold. Because the smelters are very, like... <sighs> They take so much longer than they used to. I wish they would kind of correct that. But when you get that little resource island, I think is what they call it, you need a drill. Oh, this is a steel press. This isn't even the drill. We already went over the drill. Um, this is auto miner, but this I have not got to. The steel press, you need copper plates, copper rods, steel rods. This is going to take a while. Um, this here, you need the molds, and I will show you where to get the molds. And they are hard to get. I have not gotten a mold yet. I That's the thing I've been grinding for, and I found it was easier to actually make a couple of the steel mills. That seems to be going faster, but the only problem is I'm running out of materials to make the steel mills and like I really need smelters and just like the chest and the conveyor belts and then once I can grind enough for those then it'll go a little bit faster oh um, they also have a honey press for the honey the honeycombs and you can make honey blocks um you can make a couple new foods with it um, I'm trying to think. I, no one's caramel apple. But I think it's like honey. Well, we'll go to the thing. Let me go one step at a time while I'm over here. Because there was a lot of stuff that was new that wasn't covered. Okay, so they did change the gearbox. I'm not quite sure what this it does yet. But you need copper rods, steel bolts, and steel plates, which I don't have. So, that's going to take a bit also. But here's your molds. And you need a lot of steel ingots. You can't just use iron anymore. You have to do steel for everything. So, the steel rods used to be with iron. Which were not hard to get because I have an iron farm. And I still do. But now they changed this so it, a steel rod is made of steel ingots. And the plus sign does not work on this, so you have to do them each separate. And they are very slow moving. So the only thing I can suggest until they move stuff up is what I started over here. And I've redone it a couple times. I made an area over here, and I'm going to try to put a third one here also. But I have two steel mills, 
and they don't go very fast. Normally I have a lot of these in and out to make so that I don't have to keep checking it. But they did make these bigger and they can carry more than they used to. I think they only used to carry um, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. About 45 to 50 in each. Now where it's 5, they moved it up to 30. So this is like you don't need as much space until they speed these up. But the more of these, the faster it's going to go. And you just got to have your gold. But the only problem is, is you got to get these smelters. And the smelters are so hard. Even if you go to the Pro Islands, um, before some people would drop them for free. No, they're not doing that. And they're also, most of the places are sold out like quick or they're charging on godly prices because they can because it's in such a high demand right now. Um, the only way I, I have been trying <laughs> to do the pink slimes. Normally I'm pretty lucky at them. At least I was once I had the pro and the VIP. I got one slime today after maybe like two hours all together. And then, but I mean, I did have people coming in and stealing my pink. So I don't know if they got my pink gears or not. Or if they nerfed it down a little bit. They did nerf berries, so you can only, you can't carry as many berries as you could before. I will take you to the other mining station so you can kind of see that. But before I do, I'll go to the food area because it's closer. show you the new recipes. So now they have the candy apple, the roasted honey carrot. So you use short, yeah, when you do the press you get a jar of honey. Um, you have lemon puff, honey toast, and orange honeycomb. So they're adding stuff slowly and they're trying to incorporate more stuff. So we will go over oh real quick I will show you because that reminded me so these lights here are made with the fireflies you can make different lights and lanterns out of the fireflies so that's what those do there's Another, there, you can get street lights and I think lanterns also, and you can light them up from the fireflies. And this isn't final, I was just playing around since this was the first one it made me do. Eventually, I'm gonna widen this and then I am gonna have the trees line both sides. I just kind of threw them there because I didn't get to it yet. But I wanted to like keep in my mind what my angle was. So I'll probably make this wider and then have these out. But this will be like at least four, two more, or well, one on each side. And we'll get that straightened out. But I wasn't sure if this was going to disappear or what was happening. But this is what it looks like when it actually mines it. Actually, the drill works. And it gives you some copper cores, basically. I just have, I guess I don't really need that many, but it keeps it going. I have four coals going into it, and then two coals for that. I did put the press up. But I don't have anything in it. So it says missing factory mold. But I figured when I get the other one going, I'll put in like one of these presses until I have all three. So that I can just make any molds that I want. But it's just a lot of grinding. I'm trying to think what else was new. They didn't add any islands. Um... 
they did add something recently. And I mean, it's just speculation, and I think they're trying to keep everyone kind of guessing. And we'll go over one other thing after this. So they have this building that's working here. I thought originally before they started adding to it that there was going to be a spot that possibly had all the portals so that if you had keys you didn't have to use a key for each portal. You could just go in the portal you wanted to. But my speculation is, is this might be some sort of barn because they had said that they had started with the bees and that they had the AI pretty well down. So a lot of people had said possibly do farm animals, not like adopt me animals, but farm animals that had multiple purposes. Like if you had sheep, you could use the wool and make clothing and dye the, the clothing to make shirts or clothing and sell it or cows where you could get milk um, or meat. So I don't know if they're going to add animals. But to me, it kind of looks like a barn. But I mean, it could be a big trading post. Who knows? I mean, it's a cool building. I wish we kind of had some of those materials where we could use them to build on our islands. I'm trying to think if anything else has changed. Um, they did add a mechanic. So you can sell your gearbox, which I don't know what the gearbox does. Your copper bolts or your ingots. But the thing is, you don't get very much for the ingots. And the copper bolts are like 200. Ooh, the gearbox is pretty expensive to sell. I'm trying to remember. Oh, another thing is, is they really need to fix this. And I was just playing around because I, a lot of times I have to have bread and stuff. I really didn't want it in here. But I had the material and I had it all set up. And it kind of stinks because I can't really use it. I'm, I'm hoping they fix it. But the food processors aren't working properly. These are not dropping onto the conveyor belts, and they should be, because what my intention was, was to make dough and then have it cooked here, like just have a whole bunch of dough. These three would be for dough, and then once these filled up, then this would, these three would be for bread. So it's automatically doing bread for me. And then eventually I was going to do one for like um, some of the different recipes. I didn't really want to put like crops in here. But I kind of forgot when I had it set up and I managed to use a space well. But it just sucks because about right before I got it done the food processors don't work. And I've read on their discord that it's not just me so it's not something I set up wrong that everybody is having the same problem so hopefully they'll have a bug fix here very shortly or in the next update to fix that so if your food processor isn't working it's not just you um, I did move all my stands I don't know if I showed this the last time but I did put a little sitting area here which is just like factory. Um, in real life, I used to work in, wasn't really a factory, I worked in a warehouse. So we had a break room. This would not be like a really good break room because you're around all the machinery, so it wouldn't be quiet. But I just figured, you know, if somebody was working in a factory or whatever, they might need a break and just be able to relax and sit here. So I added like a little 
break room to break everything up. I mean, too bad we didn't have like vending machines that we could put multiple food in. That would be kind of cool too. And as you get, you guys can't really see my money, but I have less than a million. So at one point I had, I think the highest I had was like 60 million. I had double digit millions. And I just, I've lost it all trying to basically fix from my inventory loss and then all the dupers that basically, let's say the spell books for the newer spell book people used to get about 25 million per spell book now you're lucky if you can get I think it's like 800,000 max that's how much they've decreased because people have duped them so bad so guys it might be cool and you might be like oh well I really need this stuff but technically that's against the TOS for Roblox don't be duping stuff because it ends up affecting everybody even if you go and you go in pro servers and you give it away, yes, you are being nice and you're helping people. But it not only is making the people that grind for that stuff, it makes them not able to sell their stuff. But it also, I've been in the pro servers and there are toxic people in there because people that used to dupe were giving all the stuff free. And the people aren't working for it. So when they couldn't give it free. Or the stuff can't be duped. Like this new stuff. People are getting really nasty and toxic. And it just. It is, isn't good. I mean this whole game is to kind of work hard. And take pride in your farm. And be able to make money off your hard work. Well it's not even worth going to the wizards anymore. Because you're lucky if you get maybe a hundred thousand for a page where it used to be you could sell the pages for at least a million each so that's a big decrease it's not even worth your time the only reason to go to the wizards is basically to get the desert key so just think before you guys do I mean you might have in your heart a good place and are trying to help people but in the long run it's it's kind of affecting everybody but hopefully this helps somebody and we are trying to get some of these videos back up and running I was gonna have wacky record a flea and an MM2 tonight he didn't get to it he um, he didn't realize that there was football on tonight so even though we're not kind of happy about everything going on um, it is something him and his dad do. So him and his dad are playing football, or well not playing football, they're watching football. And hopefully if he gets his homework done early enough tomorrow, maybe we'll record a couple videos and I'll schedule them. But I did want to let you guys know we didn't totally quit yet. Um, we are trying and I did work the last couple days my free time on this. But we have been getting busy, so... Hopefully we can start on weekends posting ahead of time and scheduling. If not, we will get videos out to you as fast as we can. So just stick with us or we will try our best. And I will see you in the next video. So bye.